And I, then Night Stalker do his own thing. I think it's 2-1-2. Two two. Like, just dual lane top yeah. with Bristol Wisp. Or maybe Wisp starts in the jungle for a bit, gets a field up. Word, and that's going to force the SMJ back. Now Air in way too deep. That glimpse sends him all the way back into a nicely set up kinetic field. And there's Mu to jump in. And it takes almost well over six minutes. But we find a very itchy trigger finger. He's like, I am ready to go with this hook shot and get something set up in the mid lane. On the back of a global silence, this could be a huge team fight for Newbie if Radiant's they want it. Middle tower is I think under they attack. actually saw June there. They have the ping nearby. Oh, that's interesting. That's a really cool Obsword. Ooh, oh, Hookshot misses. Omni Slash does not, though. Gets the kill on Lion. Airs traffic kinetic field. It's the full spin right there, plus the Sonic Way. It takes him down. And now look at the two run. Oh, it's Hyper Glory team on the retreat path out, but they can't quite get away. But hey, look at this. Nice turnaround. Bristle and Wisp, they make a go onto June here. June goes for the TP, but they scout him, and they get the quills. Clockwork goes down into being what looks like a two for one trade from both sides. Dyer's bottom tower is under attack. Slight win for newbie. Oh, doesn't stop there. Rabbit. Yeah, Rabbit gets sheathed up and taken down right there. The line has his level bottom six. Is under attack. He's up beating my ass day to day in my Dota games, so I'm happy to always see him go down. But we'll see here. Flank on bottom. Coming out from Hyper Glory team. Awkward position for Wisp as he goes toe to toe with Roche, but he's June up and above, eats the finger. Barely alive, Static Storm finishes off the Lion. They still get that Clockwork, making it one for one. Now Banana, getting a bit of a punishment for ZSMJ. Sonic Wave flies on through as they are able to get the secure kill, but back and behind, ZSMJ dance. Still don't think HGT can really contest. You'd have to have a really good impale from the Lion into like blowing up the... Ooh, I, I, I don't know who they would blow up. Yeah, they just give it up. Immortality. <laughs> yep. Sees him, throws up the vision. Uh, Kaka is as good as dead here. He tries to run away. The glimpse will be there. There's the tether, and there's the glimpse. That sonic wave helps finish him off. Take June could be scout. next, though. Okay. Skips the creep waves, because that stows the push and gets him a lot of farm. And he, he runs away because they want to fight, which is okay, too. Right. Looks like they make that call. He's looking to come in from behind, and the rest are coming in from the right-hand side. Can they get the jumping opportunity? Global's going to be called out. And now the flank comes through. Air makes his move right onto Banana, but it's Mu who gets the first takedown, dropping the Wisp immediately. San Shen going toe-to-toe -to -toe with ZSMJ, who's going to pop the BKB, but here comes Rabbit from behind, just doing serious work on his ZSMJ. He has to get the hell out of there. Trying to be safe from the... Goes for the desperate TP right in the middle and makes it out somehow. But three go down all day. Newbie, lose no one, and they want more blood. Even a chase onto Icy here, and they get the glimpse back. Oh, Bristleback is done for. Caged up. And body blocked even from June just to keep him in place. They do get the kill. Four go down all day as Newbie lose no one and take high ground. And that's it. We're done here, Owie. Hyper Glory team lose this one and our series is going to be even one to one. We'll have a game number three. Yeah, that was a pretty solid game of Newbie. They, uh, I think that was a draft too. They picked super strong supports against a Wisp Press offlane, which is really good by them. I like that a lot. Good stuff. Good stuff. So, hey, Newbie. I was a bit nervous for him in game number one, is what we already saw from DAC up to this point. I